Here we go, DCC! Y'all heads up, it's time, it's focus. Beautiful, classy, feminine. Everything would be perfect if I were that woman. It's a lot of pressure every single night. Our job is to make it look easy. Since I was little, Dallas Cowboys cheerleaders, that's what I want to do. One, two, three, DCC, woo! I love the show, but obviously being a longtime Dallas Cowboys fan, this was just extra captivating and special to watch. Um, I, you can tell it means so much to each of you to be part of the DCC, and I could really see that, especially just watching the girls get fitted in their uniforms. Mm -hmm. I was just getting chills because you could tell, like some people, it felt like Wonder Woman, and it was a very empowering moment. And um, I was just wondering, for each of you throughout this DCC journey, what has been your most empowering moment? Whoever can. Start. I think just like kind of how you took the words right out of my mouth saying that the uniform is like our Wonder Woman suit. It mm -hmm. really is because I'm honestly, whenever I'm not in a uniform that has Dallas Cowboys represented on it, I'm just Victoria. I'm just my goofy self. <laughs> but whenever I turn that uniform on, it's just like, it transforms you into this like powerful, admirable woman. And anywhere we go from reading to the kids, to hospital visits, veterans' homes. Any moment that we have that uniform on is so special. Um, I think for me, though, it's visiting the veterans in their homes. I absolutely love oh. that. Well, most empowering moment is is anytime they perform. I mean, we it it's I, I I actually love being backstage and watching them shine. It's it's very exciting. Most impactful is absolutely those small moments that. In the past, cameras haven't captured, but you, you will see it this time. You will see um, a grown man brought to tears because we visited him in a, a hospital at, in a surprise. Mm -hmm. And there's, they do that all the time. And it's just, it's just so, such a beautiful opportunity when you know you can truly lift spirits. And that's not just a sound bite. They literally yeah. brighten the room and lift spirits that they walk in. Yeah, to yeah. go off of that, the most special moments are when we go into like a children's hospital or a veterans hospital and the staff, it's happened multiple times, they'll come up to us after and say like, I haven't seen them smile in months mm -hmm. and I could tear up it's talking like, about it, but yeah. it's special. <laughs> yeah. Judy, do you have one? <laughs> well, <laughs> one of my most favorite things about picking our squad and seeing mm -hmm. the girls as they start as rookies and their growth throughout the year. And by the end of the year, they're so polished and they've become so much closer that that's, it's a fun process for me to see their growth. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, and Reese, I wanna let you say something. Yes, absolutely. I will say this is um, just a part of my why, but um, it's not what the uniform can do for us, but it's what we can do for the uniform and the organization itself. And so I mm -hmm. think the most empowering, most impactful thing is being an ambassador for America's team and not just that but we're a part of the National Football League and that's a big deal and that is global and so we not only represent the Dallas Cowboys but we're representing something greater than ourselves. Yeah no I actually when I was a kid I had a I, for Halloween I was a Dallas Cowboys Aww. cheerleader. Oh, that's right. so cute. Yeah it wasn't as <laughs> You know, legit as you but um, it was it was really cool. After working so hard your whole life, you're just so happy to have your uniform. But then there always comes the other side. I'm focusing on whether or not I should come back for a fifth year. If I find myself getting overwhelmed, I just remember why I'm here. Uh, another thing I really love about the series is just seeing how kind and supportive all the women are to each other. I, I feel like it's so easy, especially in a reality show, and that you there'd be some kind of drama. And I'm just curious, like, how do you maintain that kind of positive environment? I think that in all of our rehearsals, they up, they're uplifting to each other and they cheer each other on. And there's, doesn't, not in front of us, I've never seen any cattiness. It's like, they're just, best friends every night that get together and, and are having the time of their life and they love to dance. That was something that really shocked me coming in because I'd seen the CMT show and you think about a room full of 36 beautiful accomplished women mm -hmm. coming together, there has to be some drama, but 
I think that they do such a wonderful job in auditions. Just they take women of character, and when you put women of character in a room together, it just is different. And everyone, when I was a rookie trying to make the team, I mean, veterans would come early. They would stay late to help me. I mean, it's just an environment like no other. Everyone says not to let DCC define who you are, but in a sense, I mean, doesn't it? If I was a cowboy, I'd be the coolest.